Hello everyone. Today we will see how we can fix uh, one of the most common problem which we face while doing this kind of effect where uh, the effect as you can see has been created but instead of a blending this mesh it is getting rendered behind it. So as you see here the like the system has been kept or positioned at the correct place but uh, no matter whichever angle you'll see from it is getting rendered behind that object so let's see what are the few ways uh, which by which we can fix this problem so one of the first thing which we can do straight away is we can take uh, a material the master material and check for a depth test so this is like a disable depth test so if you switch that on and click apply then you'll see right away it will uh, fix that problem however this is not a good solution uh, because like if you have uh, like a level where there are multiple opaque objects that are there then it will see that as soon as you go behind that opaque object the fire is still visible so that means it is unable to uh, detect that depth which needs to detect based on the rendering so that is not a good solution in this case then let us go back to our previous form so now second way where we can do is is we go to the particle system itself and in our emitter if we go to a particle spawn and add a camera offset then we'll have an option parameter basically where you can fix this problem as you see here it fixed your problem like it, it actually what it does is it takes the emitter into account and push the uh, the rendering of the particle uh, towards the camera so the positive value if you keep it on camera offset it push it towards the camera and if you go negative then it actually pushes away from the camera so that's how this works so this is one of the solutions which you can do definitely uh, but what if we have to do this kind of uh, thing but it is not a multi like it is not a particle systems okay because only in particle system we have this option right but what if you have to do a material based solution so that is also possible so let us dive again into the master material so if you search for a node called camera offset so you have a similar material function of a camera offset where you can add a camera offset scalar parameter and add it to this one and in this one you need to add to your world position offset so as soon as you do that and click apply what will happen nothing is changing because the instance is applied so see we have we get a new option which is camera offset in instance so now in the same way if we increase the value you see you can see it here like how it slowly takes the particle render and bring it towards the camera so that is another very efficient way to fix this kind of problem and in this way from whichever angle you see you have that solution and even if you go behind the opaque object it's not a problem because we are not disabling the depth test so yeah this is uh, these are the two very effective ways where you can fix to this kind of problem and, and try to blend your particle system or any any uh, object translucent object with any other object so thank you hope you like it until next time bye bye